Looks like we're back on the Wii again. The walk of the... Oh. Okay, never mind. Today we're playing Pikmin. Now, why are we playing Pikmin? I don't know. Because I want to play Pikmin. Um, so, of course, this series will replace um, Ratchet and Clank due to not being able to publish all the rest of the episode. But not to worry, I can definitely work with Pikmin um, as soon as it finishes creating files of which that I'm going to use. So let's start up a new log and begin our journey to a vast new world. The world... Oh. Oh look, it's the dolphin. The SS Dolphin. As it makes our way traveling through. Oh no! A rock has decided to that looks like a star piece in terms of shaping, actually. I think that might have been like a dusted up star piece. Mario, you did this. You did this, Mario. There you go, the theories. Oh no, the SS Dolphin is crashing. Oh no, it is spiraling down to a unknown planet of which we haven't decided the name of just yet. Oh no, it's falling apart, but we know which one we are. Well, that is a nice looking steel image of a foreign location. <clears throat> Welcome to the impact site. Mario Kart, he wants his star back. Oh no, the ship has been destroyed. My name is Captain Olimar. While traveling through space, my ship was struck by a meteor. I must have blacked out and awoke on the surface of a weird planet. With so many parts lost, the skeletal hull of my beloved dolphin is a painful sight. The engine is gone. I'm stranded. To make, so, ah, fuck. To make matters worse, my atmospheric sensors indicate that this planet's environment contains high levels of poisonous oxygen. My life support systems can only function for, oh, for 30 days. If I can't repair the dolphin by then, no. Better not think about it. I must find the missing parts. And of course, we've got all the weird camera. We can play the motion controls. And punch it. Whistle. And there seems to be a large group. And I, I don't know if you can hear. Oh, okay, so you should be able to hear my Wiimote echo through to you guys. So that's going to be fun to work with. Hold up a jiggy. I'm going to turn that down. There you go. That's good. That's all good. And we seem to have found a weird spacecraft looking doohickey. A strange thing has a hid before me. I had barely begun my search when it reared us as it was it reared up as if it was waiting for me. It then dropped a single seed. What is it? Is it alive? Is it a machine? It resembles a vegetable from my home planet. That we call an onion. I shall call this an onion too. Sweet. Punch the flower. Punch the flower. What is this? What could it be? The seed that the onion dropped took root in the soil and has produced a adorable little sprout. This sprout emits a strange light and it sways back and forth without the benefit of wind. I cannot help but think it's calling to me. I'm compelled. I must approach it and press A. I'm gonna pull it out. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna stop with the voice. It's really doing me in. Extraordin extraordinary! 
Extraordinary. I plucked the sprout. It turned out to be a living creature, not a plant. Pinging it up has done no visible damage. It just stands there, staring at me. Menacingly! Its shape is similar to a pick to the Pick Pick brand carrots. I love so much. I shall call it a Pikmin. And now it's teaching me the buttons. Which is very nice. Teach me how to use the camera and all that. Do that thing, yeah. Got a lot of tutorials, ain't ya? Hmm. Might have to adjust the screen for you guys. It looks kind of bright. Actually, not too bad. It looks really dark on my TV. Astonishing, the onion has sown more seeds. The small red pellet the Pikmin harvested after cutting down a flower appears to be some type of food that can prop, 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 propagate sure. that can send more Pikmin. The onion seems to be a sort of incubator. Lead, incubator, leading us to say, I must study this strange life for more. Bada boom. Got any more plants? I'll get that one. This game is good. It's it's annoyingly teaching me. It's teaching me how to play the game through dialogue. But um, learning through like the numbering system and the fact that using so many Pikmin to do whatever like. Using red Pikmin on the red pellets gives me one extra Pikmin for it in the job, which is good game design. Hey, oh, that's one up there. I'm gonna pick that up in a minute. Where are you? I'll throw you as soon as you get over there. There you go. You guys are sprouted now, so I can picky you up. Haha, <laughs> Pikmin, picker you up. Oh, that's bad. So, I haven't done a um, solo recording in a while. Um, the last one was Ratchet and Clank, and I was. Oh, look how good I am. Oh, for God's sake, you guys get yourself stuck. Alright, okay, I get you. Now we should be carrying that one back. Just need to make sure I'm doing enough with these guys. There you are. Get them to do that. Just get a quick flip in there while they're uh, going off. Really need to make sure Skype isn't going while I'm recording. Oh, there we go. The Pitmen are a, as curious as a child. They perform group. They they form groups to perform tasks that would be impossible for an individual. A glimmer of hope has begun to shine in my heart. If I can make use of their skills, perhaps I can fix my ship. I shall sum up all I've learned from the Pikmin conduct. Approach there. It's basically just teaching me all the button commands. So at least the Wiimote looks kind of cool. To, uh, and it lights up. Alright, cool. I'll just grab these last two here. Before I decide to do anything. On this day, I just collect all the Pikmin I require. Mm. 
Ähm, du, 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 du. I'm pushing down the high ledges. Can't do anything with that yet because we need the bomb. We need the bombs. But we ain't got no bombs. Where do we get the bombs from? And I've already decided to pick it up or try it anyway. Um, amazing. There's no mistake in it. My ship's engine res rests before my very eyes. By a stroke of pure luck, I've already stumbled upon the most important piece of the damaged craft. Fate has smiled upon me. But how will I get it back to the dolphin? Manual labor. Work, my pick pick. Get to these guys. Wait for everyone to be ready. I'll throw these nerds at it. It's the Wii Mode's more precise. Ooh. The Wii Mode's a lot more precise than the GameCube control when playing this. When many Pitmen sprout more than once, I'd rather find it tedious, tedious to pluck them from the ground individually. individually. My wife always told me there's an R oh, for God's sake. I'm keep pressing A because I'm trying to go. Yes. But meanwhile, I just want to get this done. Get them all. Pick them all up. Pick them all up. Pick them all up. Pick them all up. Pick them all. Yeah, zoom that camera out. I want to do it. Do the thing. There you go. Um. There's no more items to worry about in this area, so. I'll check up there. Um, no. Alright, so as soon as I've done that, we're pretty much done for the day. Oh, I have an idea. Before you guys do that, I'm gonna shoot on a later date. If I ever decide. Never mind, you'll suck. Do the thing! Yeah. Wait. Oh, I want to start to fall on there. Okay. I've probably dizzied someone by now. I'm so sorry. I can't work on my troops. But, um, there we go. Fix yourself up. Looking snazzy. Snazzy. Whee! Glory! Oh, glorious. With the help of these Pikmin, I've taken a huge step back towards home. My ship can once again lift off. A glimmer of hope. The glimmer of hope is beginning to burn more brightly. But what's become of the remaining parts? That search starts tomorrow. Oh, then them all ran off. Apart from this guy who's just following me. Oh no, he's gone. But um, of course that is day one completed for this game. So from me, that is the tutorial. I mean, what were you expecting? Can't say much of this. Although, I wish I could have actually taken out that wall there. Day one since impact, I have somehow managed to launch the dolphin, but I was surprised to see the onion lift off with me. Perhaps the Pikmin cannot survive overnight on the planet's surface, or have they merely decided to join me for other reasons? Either way, 
It seems they will help me again tomorrow. The dolphin is missing 29 pieces. If I cannot recover them all, I may never return home to my family on planet Hockatee. Analyzing analysts show life support systems will function for only 29 more days. How can I repair my dolphin in such a short time? A dense forest is visible on the surface below. It holds the keys to my survival. I will name it the Forest of Hope. I will explore it tomorrow. And of course, there we go. The Pikmin population has risen. Sprouted 25 today. That's all the major stuff that will be important later. So I'm just going to save the game. Get on with it. And of course, tomorrow, we next time, we will head to the Forest of Hope. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this series beginning. If you want to continue watching, don't forget to subscribe so you can get notified as soon as more Pikmin arises. And with that said, I have been Pokedoot Red, and I will see you all in the next episode. Mm, goodbye.